guys, so today I am going to be doing a what's in my bag. I was going to film this video like a month ago or something like that when I got my new camera but my camera was faulty as you, if you watched my previous, not my previous video but the one uh, where I filmed it on my webcam telling you about the situation with my whole camera and all that. Well, they gave me another camera. The camera was faulty, I took it back, so now I have a new camera, which is amazing. <laughs> it's a really good camera, it's really good at focusing, and yeah, I absolutely love it. So, anyway, I'm finally getting around to filming this, which I'm so pleased about, before we move as well. So, this here is my bag. I got it from Strand Bags, um, probably about a month ago actually or a few weeks ago, I don't know, I got it from Strand Bags anyway and um, I've only had it for a few weeks but I have accumulated so much junk in it I don't even know how to do it so yeah let's find out just what kind of junk I keep in my bag <laughs> okay so what the first thing that's on the top is a pack of tissues because in case you can't tell I have a cold so I've had to carry lots of tissues around with this I keep like wiping my nose Lovely that is. Um, put those down there. The second thing is a tissue. Don't worry, it's not tissue from a cold. It's got lipstick on it. <laughs> I was um, swatching lipsticks at Posty Plus with my mum the other day and um, put the tissue in my bag. <laughs> Didn't end up buying any of the lipsticks which I swatched though. But I did end up buying a lipstick that's in my Get Ready With Me video which I just filmed. I have this wallet from Bluebird. Got it from Strand Bags once again. Absolutely love it. If it's going to focus on it. It's got like this really cool pattern on it. And um, oh look, receipts. This is what it looks like on the inside. And it's super cool and I really like it. And what a pity the money fairies haven't been and given me any notes while I was gone. <laughs> anyway. Um, Sunglasses. I always keep a spare pair of sunglasses in my bag because, like, seriously, guys, I'm so bad at getting to bring my sunglasses. So, I've had these sunglasses for like years now. Oh, look, it makes my hair go funny. Let's not wear those. <sighs> I feel like you guys are, like so far away. It's like ah. Oh. <laughs> so, uh, next thing in my bag. Another box or a little packet of tissues, only this one's actually open. I was actually using these ones. Um, an umbrella. It's summer here in New Zealand, but I still carry an umbrella in my bag because we haven't been having very summery weather recently. So um, I just like always carry an uh, umbrella with me, especially since I don't have my license yet, so I do tend to walk if I'm going somewhere, so it's always handy to have an umbrella. A receipt for the warehouse. What did I buy? Oh, that's when I brought my webcam actually. That's an important receipt. Probably shouldn't lose that. Another receipt. Where's this one for? Warehouse stationery from when I brought my headset for gaming. A tissue. Not yours, by the way. None of the tissues that I find in here are actually yours, by the way. They're just random and they're just all scrunched up because, like, they're in my bag. A little purse. This purse is actually super cute. Um, I keep all of my cards in here. Like, I personally don't have cards, but, like, all the cards which I collect from people. Um, I have a lot of cards, Jess. Um, <laughs> I keep them all in here because sometimes somebody might say to me, oh, do you have so-and-so's number or do you know their address or something? And I might have their card and be like, yes and look like a genius and well organized person. Mascara! Because you never know when you're going to need to apply another skirt, another, another skirt, another coat of mascara. Um, this is actually my old volumizer mascara. I don't actually know what the brand is, it's like all rubbed off now. But um, I've had this mascara for quite a while now. And then I just brought myself a new one the other week, so I put this one, which isn't quite empty, in my bag. And then I, that's just sort of what I do. 
sticky plasters because okay guys I am like the worst person I swear that I cut myself on everything like I don't know how I do it but I just like cut myself on everything I like the other week I was making um, the bunk bed at my nana and granddad's house where I was staying and there was like a little nail sticking out from under and I cut my wrist and I was like great only I would do that <laughs> but yeah I seem to cut myself on everything so I find it really important to keep stick plasters on my bed and in case you don't know it of course another receipt for the warehouse stationery an ankle brace because I have really bad ankles and um, I twist them a lot and sometimes they just like randomly get sore so sometimes I just have to put on an ankle brace so it's always handy for me to carry an ankle brace um, a pad because girls you know that's always handy to have some more tissues a tiny little notepad thing in a leather case which is really cool and cute because I always need to write something down a pair of earphones because earphones are always handy if you have to like walk somewhere and you want to listen to music and make your life a little bit more jazzy <laughs> hand sanitizer because that always comes in handy especially if you've just like been out somewhere and then you're gonna go and eat like if you've been to the shops and be like trying things on or touching lots of things and picking things up and all that and then you're going to go and eat and you have like finger food it's always good to have some hand sanitizer so you can sanitize your hands or just if you like putting hand sanitizer on deodorant because deodorant is always handy to have a spare one of <laughs> lip balm because I'm like obsessed with lip gum with lip balm and if I don't have lip balm with me I start to freak out and feel like I need to buy one. Compressed powder, which is nearly empty. It's my old one, by the way, guys. I just keep that in there because it's, you know, just what you do. A makeup brush for my powder or anything else that you might need it for. Sorry, guys. I've, like, with this new camera, it has a turnaround screen, and I keep looking at myself on the screen going, no, I need to look at the camera. Lipstick. Orchard Pash. It's a nice dark colour. I always like to keep lipstick with me because sometimes just need a little bit of formal look and lipstick gets you that. Hand cream because I get dry hands. So that comes in handy. <laughs> handy. A nail file. A really mini nail file. <laughs> Like seriously, I damage my nails all the time, and then I'll get, and then I will catch them on every single thing possible. So I always have to carry a nail file with me. A pen, which is always handy when you have a notepad. That, a silicon, silicon, silica gel thingy, which probably should be thrown out and I don't actually know where that came from because I threw the one in my bag out so cool <laughs> that's funny if it zooms up it like changes everything around it <laughs> sorry guys easily amused <laughs> another lip balm a Christmas lip balm what's more it's got a little snowman on it because you know I think it's um cherry flavour Yep, cherry. Yeah. Some lavender fragrance because lavender is always nice. <laughs> Some nail polish, which I got. Oh, that's showing up a really bad color on here. That's showing up like a really dull purple. It's actually a really like bright sort of purple. It's cool. I got it for three dollars from Kmart. I like it. Lip gloss! An Avon lip gloss, and I don't know what colour it is, but once again, it's not showing up the same colour on camera, but it's a nice dark purple colour. Concealer! Cover stick with tree tree, tea tree oil by W7 in light medium. 
Um, this concealer is actually the first ever concealer which I brought, which I brought like a while back because I only just got into makeup. And seriously, it's more like a foundation, like it's so cakey. I just, yeah. But now I have the Maybelline one, I think, um, that's in like the little tube, like the lip gloss sort of thing. And it's not lip gloss, but you know what I mean. <laughs> um, I love it. But it's always handy to have this. But I do actually use this more as a foundation. Um, than a concealer. Another tissue. A compact mirror. I love this compact mirror. I got it off like Trade Me a while back and um, oh it needs a clean. But um, yeah, it's really cool. My keys, because keys are always handy. Especially if you're trying to get into the car or the house or something. That's it for the inside part. A tissue. That's from these little pockets up front here, guys. There's nothing in that one. Oh god, my hand's stuck. And what's in this little front compartment here? Drugs! <laughs> no, just kidding, guys. No, seriously, I am kidding. Um, these are peppermint tea bags. See, it's even written on the packet. You probably can't read my handwriting because I have like such bad ha handwriting, but like seriously guys, peppermint tea fixes like everything for me. So like I always carry peppermint tea bags. Like if I get stomach cramps, if I'm feeling sick or just feeling really bad or whatever, um, peppermint tea seems to fix my guts up pretty well. So I keep peppermint tea bags. And that is it for the contents of my bag. But, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I was going to make it, like I said, a while back. Um, I think I actually might have mentioned it when I did my video on my webcam about my camera not working. Um, or I might have put it below. I am not actually sure whether I did mention it or not. But, um, yeah, I was going to do it. But it's done there anyway. This will be uploaded. The next video that's going up will probably be me dyeing my hair brown, in case you haven't noticed I dyed it brown. And I know that I just uploaded two videos of me dyeing my hair blonde, but I actually filmed those back in November, I think, or possibly December. And then, um, well I didn't have my camera, I managed to just make that a two-part series. So yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video, and leave a comment, leave a like, give me thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and leave any requests that you might have and I shall see you guys very soon. Oh and by the way before I go, I might, not quite sure, let me know, give this video a thumbs up or, oh pardon me, a comment or something, let me know if you want me to do a moving vlog. I am moving this weekend so this is the last video that you're going to see with the setup. I do actually have a room tour and wardrobe tour, there's my wardrobe, not over there, um, coming out in the next couple of weeks and then in about a month or so once my new room and wardrobe is all set up and I'm happy with it, I will be doing an updated one, so yeah. But let me know if you want me to do the moving vlog or not, I'm kind of happy either way, so yeah, I shall see you guys very soon.